Besides Earth, Moon was the only heavenly mass where man landed and had a glimpse of it. On July 20th, 1969, two American astronauts, Armstrong and Edwin, became the first men to set foot on the moon. The name of their spacecraft was Apollo 11, which was locked with another spacecraft, Eagle 2. As Apollo 11 remained on the surface of the moon, Eagle 2 revolved around the moon. Aboard the Eagle 2 was a third astronaut, Michael Collins. The astronauts left such instruments and machines on the moon which continued to send their observations about the moon to the observatories on the earth and opened new avenues in the field of space and moon exploration. Both the USSR and the USA had worked out program for the exploration of moon. The US sent its astronauts were as the USSR sent its spaceships. The USSR did not feel it necessary to land man on the moon to carry on exploration. In September 1970, the Soviet scientists sent a spacecraft called Luna 16 with a robot on board to carry out experiments on moon's surface. Moreover, it was also less expensive and above all, human life was not endangered. The moon is the Earth's only natural satellite. It is a quarter of the Earth's diameter, measuring 3,476 kilometers. Its distance from the Earth is 3,84,405 kilometers. Its surface is pitted with craters caused by meteorites. The moon is the same age as the Earth, about 4,600 million years old. It is not a self-luminous body, as the moon orbits the Earth, different amount of its sunlit surface is visible from the Earth that produces the cycle known as phases of the moon. The average daily delay in moonrise and moonset is about 50 minutes. A very light rain of cosmic dust continually falls on it. In the glare of the sun, lunar rocks reach a temperature of 110 degree centigrade. But in shadows, the temperature goes down to less than minus 100 degree centigrade. The moon lacks water and has no atmosphere. Some useful metals like aluminium, titanium and iron have been found on moon. The Soviet scientists have declared the moon unfit for human inhabitation. However, some scientists still feel that moon can be made inhabitable for men by separating oxygen from elements which contain oxygen. Researchers on moon for over three decades have shattered many traditional beliefs about it. But in spite of the knowledge, poets and lovers continue to sing of the beauties of this heavenly body and compare the faces of their beloveds to this lovely satellite. <laughs>